as we are here at the shore of the Mediterranean, we're here so that we can learn a little bit better what one of God's promises to the prophet Isaiah meant when he was talking to him about the deliverance that he was going to send for all people. You see, Isaiah ministered to God's people at a very difficult time. Uh, the nation of Israel had already been torn in two. The Assyrians had taken many of the Jewish people off into captivity. Babylon was also knocking on the door and would soon take the capital city of Israel, Jerusalem. And even in the spite of that terrible odds and the difficult things that they were going through, God promised that he would love his people in a way that no earthly enemy, no foe could ever diminish our joy or our life or the love that we have received from God. And this is how that promise is described in Isaiah 51 verse 5. Here God says to the prophet, My righteousness draws near, my salvation has gone out, and my arms will judge the peoples. The coastlands hope for me, and for my arm they wait. That line, the coastlands wait for me. In that, what Isaiah was saying is that the farthest reaches of the earth would know the love of God, specifically as it come to us in Jesus Christ, his Son, who is our righteousness. And you can see here the Mediterranean little islands dot all around the Mediterranean. And for the prophet Isaiah, as far as he knew the world existed, was pretty much the Mediterranean Sea and the, the coastlands. We think of the areas of, around Greece and, and, and Italy. These were the farthest corners of the earth at that point in time as Isaiah knew it. And so when he wrote those words under inspiration of the Holy Spirit, he was writing a promise that transcends distance and transcends time. A promise that includes you and a promise that includes me. Because in Jesus Christ, God has wrapped his arms around all of humanity. He has embraced us with his love. He has promised that nothing, no earthly trial, no adversity, no adversary can do anything to diminish God's love for us. And this promise is a wonderful reminder of that. Even though we live in a continent the prophet Isaiah had no idea even existed. We are included in this promise because, as we said before, it includes the farthest reaches of the earth because nowhere is out of the reach of God's love. Please pray with me. We thank you, dear Father in heaven, for the promise of salvation that you've given us in your son Jesus Christ, for the prophet Isaiah, who waxed poetically about your love, describing it as a love that went to the farthest reaches of the earth, we thank you so much for this love because we know there is no place that we can go that we will be removed from you or your blessing because your love for us is everywhere that we could ever go. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Blessings on your day. Thanks for watching. We hope you enjoyed the video. Click the icon to subscribe or explore more of our video lessons on our channel.